Hey everybody in Asheville, Alabama. I'm Sammy Hodges, pastor at Asheville Evergreen United Methodist Church. I'm going to be coming to you on Monday of Holy Week and preaching Matthew 21, 1 through 11, just the simple subject of who is this. I look forward to seeing you there. Hey, I'm Nicholas Gandy. I'm the pastor of Friendship Baptist Church. I'll be preaching on Tuesday of Holy Week from Mark chapter 12, verses 28 to 34. Hey guys, I'm Michael Mills, the senior pastor of Greensport Baptist Church. And I want to invite you to join us Wednesday online as we look at Philippians 2, 5 through 11 and the mentality of Christ as he approached the cross and what that means for you and I today. Hey, I'm Shane Bearden, the lead pastor at Flow Church, and I will be speaking Thursday at Holy Week on 1 Corinthians chapter 11, where Jesus said, as often as we take the Lord's Supper, to do so in remembrance of him. Can't wait to see you. Hello, I'm Jay Stewart, pastor of First Baptist Church, Asheville. And I am looking forward to next week being Holy Week. For over 20 years now, First Baptist has hosted Holy Week services. And I'm looking forward to preaching on Good Friday, passage out of Isaiah chapter 53 about the suffering servant. Won't you join us? Luke 24, 1 through 12. But on the first day of the week, at early dawn, they went to the tomb taking the spices they had prepared. And they found the stone rolled away from the tomb, but when they went in, they did not find the body of the Lord Jesus. And while they were perplexed about this, behold, two men stood by them in dazzling apparel. And as they were frightened and bowed their faces to the ground, the men said to them, Why do you seek the living among the dead? He is not here, but has risen. Remember how he told you while he was still in Galilee that the Son of Man must be delivered into the hands of sinful men and be crucified, and on the third day rise. And they remembered his words, and returning from the tomb, they told all these things to the eleven and to all the rest. Now it was Mary Magdalene and Joanna and Mary, the mother of James, and the other women with them, who told these tales to the apostles. But these words seemed to them an idle tale, and they did not believe them. But Peter rose and ran to the tomb. Stooping and looking in, he saw the linen cloths by themselves, and he went home marveling at what had happened. We want to encourage you next week, which is Holy Week, to join us live on Facebook uh, at First Baptist Church uh, for Holy Week services. We'll begin at noon, and we look forward to you joining with us to worship God. God bless.